qualification match number 58. Drivers behind your line in three, two, one, go. We've got full strength on both sides for qualification match number 58. 55 49 is releasing a cavalcade of power cells into that upper port. Upper port scores during the autonomy period worth double than Teleop. Drivers taking control of their robots now. It's the Red Alliance in the lead 25 to 18. 55 49 Griffin Robotics working on that trench run on the far side, trying to get themselves aligned with a shot. Meanwhile, for the Red Alliance, we've got our rookie squad, Generals Robotics, getting a few power cells from their human player station. Griffin Robotics shots go wide north of that outer port. Meanwhile, on the Red Alliance, we've got 29-12, Panther Robotics scoring in that local for one point apiece. And oh, we've got all six robots now towards the Blue Alliance side of the field. And 5549 Griffin Robotics makes their way back to the blue sector. A little bit of defense being played by the Blue Alliance as they leave Griffin Robotics to the offensive maneuvers. Over a minute to play, and it's the Red Alliance with the lead, 44 to 25. Still plenty of robotics action to play, though. We'll see if the off from Griffin Robotics can keep up the pace with the scoring cavalcade of the Panther Robotics. Trying to get all of their power cells scored in that lower goal. Going into our <laughs> end game with 30 seconds left. We've got the Red Lions in the lead, 63 to 25. Robo Loco trying to show how crazy they are, trying to hang off that switch on the near side. Panther Robotics joining them up in the red rendezvous point, extending that elevator hook. Can they both hang here? They've got 10 seconds left. Will we see a double hang and a balance? Red Alliance needing to keep this one up in the air to solidify a win in the books. We'll have your official results in just a moment. Both alliances had high hopes, but only one can win, and it's the Red Alliance with a score of 100 to 30.